What's going on guys and welcome to another satisfactory video. Update 6 has officially launched on Experimental. Yep, on Experimental. So make sure before you switch over to this branch, you back up your save. So the main menu has got a brand new image. And you can see there's a little pioneer down here with his little car and he's just at his crafting table because he's handcrafting and he's got a little booty. <laughs> but also we've got the new crab spawners. Ow! So that does mean crabs come out in their waves. But the devs thought of everything because I wanted to see how many we can spawn and we can't spawn that many. I think this is the actual amount because they keep trying to despawn every so often and they attack a lot more. Ow, ow. But just look how pretty this biome look. It's now my new favorite. But also, for all those people that know me, know that I don't heal. I don't eat pale berries. I don't eat them. But now, they've actually implicated a full heal system. We don't just heal to three boys anymore. But just look at the new skybox. It's absolutely insane. And I'm super impressed with the volumetric clouds. And yes, if you see them dark clouds coming over, it will rain. But if you go into the option settings, you can see now there is a couple more options available for you to choose. You can see cloud quality, use volumetric clouds, and screen space reflections. What are screen space reflections, you must ask? It basically adds reflections to water surfaces to give it much more detail and depth and just broadening the visual aspect. And with that in mind, you got the god rays coming in. You can even see all the bioilluminescence on the rocks and on the mushroom formation rocks things. But the new spire course is something truly like it is out of like Avatar or something. It's stunning. And I'm going to keep saying it. I'm going to keep saying it. But on the east coast of the map, yes, something evil lurks. Yep, and that is the new swamp biome. But yeah, it's definitely a place that is a lot spookier, especially with a fog as well. But also, if you notice, there are dead willow trees. Rest in peace, willow trees. But also, we can see the new alpha spitters are here as well, with their green, very rundown textures, and also the big horns on the back of its head. Incoming. But do you want to know something more spookier that has been implemented? is the spiders now leap at you. And speaking of mobs, we can now sneak up behind the actual mobs and then give them a good old whack and they won't even know you're coming. <laughs> but that one yeets itself. Look, you see it? It's bouncing around. Oh boy. I don't know why that's a thing. I think it's a bug, but all I want you to do in the comments below is do hashtag blame limb. That is it. Also, if you press H, you can now holster your weapon. Next up, we have a little bit of a change to the MAM. Yes, we've had a bit of a change. If you look in the Sulfur node now, we can now see a new branch and we can see the alternate recipes that required an alternate recipe to be unlocked before. I think I got that right. But now, if you go into the Sulfur node, we can see we can get Compacted Coal and we can also see Turbo Fuel in here. Okay, so hear me out. So I just went to type in Give Jetpack, all one word, and look what come up. Jetpack Mark II? Hello? And if I go into my inventory, there is a placeholder image. And if we right click and click open index, Jetpack Mark II, a better jetpack. Huh? Maybe just the placeholder, maybe just a troll, maybe something to come. Hello? But you can see I've also got turbo fuel in my inventory. I've got the jetpack on and I'm allowed to fly. I think we've just discovered a bug. Maybe. But if I give myself 100 package fuel, that is now coming up in the bottom left. So I don't know if that is a thing to come or a thing we can use right now. So if you want unlimited fuel, I guess just put that in your pocket. But if devs, if you're watching this and you fix this, the guys that are watching this might get a little angry. <laughs> but yeah, well, you can use turbo fuel for unlimited fuel right now. So do it while it's still 
hot until it gets fixed. But now that we've got more body slots, we've got a head slot, body slot, back slot, leg slot, and more hand slots, and one, I can finally remove the e empty hands mod, which I use to holster weapon weapons because we can now holster them. But my new combo I have to go to is Blade Runners and Jetpack. Hopefully, this does not get changed because for replayability purposes, I think this is going to be very, very beneficial. So we can now sprint and just get further distance with the jetpack. Maybe if they do want to kind of nerf this a bit, maybe just reduce the amount of fuel. Well, increase the amount of fuel that we can actually is consumed through the jetpack instead of changing it. Maybe that's a thought. But we've also got some new Nobelisk, which is just a normal. A cluster, which I find very useful to remove shrubbery and bushes. So much easier. But then we've also got the gas one as well. Bean catch. And then he is now going to run around like a fart cloud. Actually, no. It stayed there. And then, yes, we have the daddy. The nuclear bomb. Boom. That's animation. And you can see we are now getting radiation poisoning as well. But also, we've got the new weapons, which that one was the scatter one. But as we know as well, there's a lot of stuff to the reboys and the rifle as well. But my favorite is definitely the shotgun. Because one, it just killed that whole egg in one. Uh-oh. So in my eyes, personally, I think they need to be a little bit stronger. Because they take two hits with the basher and they also take one hit with the shotgun. So I think just for balance purposes, just on my opinion, I think these could do with a bit of, bit of a boost. Because that is a little bit too easy. But then again, this is a factory game and not a tower defense game. Or golf. Right? Right. <laughs> but I almost forgot as well, there's also a pulse nobelisk. We nearly forgot about it. But this one, actually, if you stand on it, detonate, you can see it, it pulses us away. It blasts us away. So I'm thinking is if we get one and you've got the jetpack and you've got the blade runners, you throw it down in front of you, you then slide, jump, detonate, you actually get a bit of a boost and you can jetpack away with a little bit more speed. So the next thing is actually in the awesome shop and it's something that I've been asking for so long now since update 5 dropped and that's because I am very focused on new players so they can play the game and come in and not get confused on why certain people have this and certain people have that but if we go into the awesome shop we can actually see now the concrete coated foundation is actually unavailable but if we look to the right of it it says why it's because we don't have oil processing which is in the hub and tier 5 and we don't have base building in the hub tier 1 so that means I can then focus them as objectives and go and get them if I want to. And it's like that for new enough most things. Unavailable. We can come down here. Unavailable. Unavailable. Why? Because I've not done any silica yet. We've not made any silica. So, yeah. So, for all you new people, and you can actually stop asking me all the questions now. Where did you get that item from? Where did you get that? Just highlight it. You'll see it. And if you guys leave it in the comments, you are trolls. You are trolls. Okay. But it's not just the awesome shop as well, it's inside the MAM as well. As you can see right here, as soon as you unlock Quartz Crystals, you can see new shop products. Which means you can go to the awesome shop and you can go and purchase whatever you've just unlocked. Or it's an achievement or, or an accomplishment or an objective, whichever, which one ever it is, <laughs> which whatever it is towards that recipe that you're after and there we have it guys if you've enjoyed this video remember to like subscribe and also check out my other satisfactory content here i have a whole playlist click on it give it a click do it do it and then also here's some recommended content from my channel that you might enjoy and as always keep smiling and i'll see you in the next video and now i'm gonna die to poison great fantastic and now bees crabs whatever they are i forgot what they crabs that's it right